Hi everyone, I got my Bissell Big Green today. Um, I've been wanting to get one of these for several years now, and my Bissell Premier Pet Liftoff, the hose finally tore on it, just like my SpotBot did. And this at least has a nine foot hose that um, detaches, it doesn't stay on the machine and it would be easier to replace and service if anything else happened to it. So I just bit the bullet and bought a big green. Looks like we got a manual. Looks like a registration card yet. Don't know who mails things. I did trade this box in and it seems like it's quite a bit heavier than my other vessel, but it's like an entry level commercial model, so it should be a little heavier. And let's see. Okay. More packaging, that's nice. Tank, you got your solution line. Has a gasket around here, actually, two gaskets one here and here, so it should have some pretty good suction. <laughs> has a nice handle, and it's got a this is like the six inch. I'm going to have to call this one a tough stain tool as well. But it looks like, I think this one might be a little different than some of the others. It looks like this uh, set of bristles pop out and you can replace them. And they look like they might be protruding a little farther than some of the other ones. Maybe this is just a change Bissell made. I don't know if that's specific to just this big green or not. And I know in all my other ones, these tools used to be completely clear and see-through. Now it's like a translucent plastic. Kind of see the reflection of it. But that would be really nice for doing upholstery and uh, car interiors for sure. And then I don't think there's really much assembly involved. I think you just got to... Here's the dirty solution tank. The water comes up from the nozzle through here and then dumps in. This would be where you put your um, put the hose in to get suction uh, to the hose for the dirty water. solution tank. Okay, it just has a, that's just to keep the, I'm losing the cap really. It might, oh, it looks like it's a vent as well. But it's nice that it has a little barb there to keep from losing the cap. Have a nice handle that locks. It's got kind of the same valve as the other Bissells. So 
got a little screen on it, I guess, to catch any sediment in your water. So it is a little, built a little differently than the consumer grade models for sure. Okay, that's actually helpful. It tells you that this is the front. That sits in there nicely. This is where the suction would come from for when you put your solution or your dirty water tank on it. Suction comes from here and then goes through your nozzle or to uh, the hose. Clean and protect this old pro. Hmm. Never really saw this formula before, but I never really had a professional model pistol either. Should be. Yeah, okay, there is three of these. Did I get what it was supposed to come with? I'm not going to open any of these because I have plenty of other solution I want to use up first. Just locks it on there, and I guess I guess the tank just it basically sits on there. Gravity don't really actually lock on. Got some rubber grips on. is your on off and it is a bubble switch it's protected so if you have wet hands you shouldn't get any water in the switch and reduces your chance of getting shocked I guess you wrap the cord like this it has a really thick cord on thicker than anything I've really seen I figure that's probably so you don't run over and rip the insulation off with the brush work on this, which I'll show you in just a second. But it's nice that the handle folds down. It'll make it a lot easier to store and even to transport like in a vehicle. You don't have all the height then. You don't have to put it on its side or anything. Does have like a carrying handle you can lift from the front. Okay. And you got the nice big one brush roll on this. It does float with a little bit of weight to it. And here's where your suction comes to extract. Everything's actually built really nice on this machine. 
got some room to help it glide back and forth. All right, so I'll make some other videos of using it and testing it out, and we'll see how it all works. I hope you guys liked the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe.